March of 2021, I overdosed and I was in the hospital for almost two months. I was in a medically induced coma for 19 days um, because the doctors didn't know how long I was out before and they took all the precautions to keep my brain from continuously swelling and so I was in a coma for 19 days and then in the ICU for the next month and then in a recovering um, uh, hospital for um, physical therapy for the next month. I, when I came back, I couldn't walk. My right wrist had wrist drop, um, radial nerve palsy, and coming from my neck down my right wrist, like I couldn't lift my fingers, I couldn't lift my right arm. Luckily I'm left-handed, so that worked out well, but I couldn't control my wrist at all. It was in a splint and uh, it had to be propped up and everything, so I had to wear that 24 seven. And then, um, so uh, all the occupational therapists and doctors and nerve doctors and everything said it'd be close to a year to a year and a half before my wrist came back and I could start controlling it. And I mean, if I laid my hand flat, I could not lift any of my fingers. I couldn't do any of that. I started coming here and, and I talked to Dr. Well and everything got set up and pretty much just listened to him. I didn't know what else to do. I just listened to him. I didn't know anything about anything. And he's helped me with the poles machine and the uh, stem pod and also with the adjustments and everything. And just, I just pretty much listened to him, what he had to say and everything and what to do. And uh, so I started maybe in June and then by August, I could start moving my fingers already. And so everything he was doing was speeding up the process. And I was also going to occupational therapy, but that didn't start maybe until November. And by then I could lift my wrist up. I couldn't control it up, but I could lift my wrist up. I still didn't have any strength in it or anything. And uh, so I'd obviously just continue to come in here and all then I went back for my final checkup in December to my neurologist and he was completely shocked that I could lift my wrist up, I could lift my fingers up and everything because it's only been six months since, well, yeah, March to March to December, so eight months uh, since I can control my wrist and everything. So he was completely shocked, said he's never seen uh, someone develop, come back from that fast. So I was happy about that. And <clears throat> like, I mean, I could not even do this and I can do that now. I can do everything now. And I have complete control of it. I have strength in it. I have feeling in it. It was also tingly and as well as like, like super sensitive, I could barely touch it and stuff. But now just, I mean, weird to say, but it just feels like a regular arm and wrist now. Um, so everything that Dr. Wells said, or I just followed it and it's surprising. And even he's shocked as well too, as long as with me and my parents or my mother. And uh, it's just ridiculous how fast it came back and I couldn't be more happier. <laughs>